What is up YouTube? Mike from the Hardcover Comic here, and today we're looking at... I believe this is still, at the moment of recording, the newest Rebirth Deluxe Edition that we've had. This is Action Comics Volume 2. Um, I know this came out a little while ago. It actually took me longer than I thought it would to get it. I thought I had it pre-ordered on Amazon. It turns out I didn't. Um, its release just sort of snuck by me and finally got around to picking it up. Um... As always, the design has not changed yet. Um, so let's see, we've got 90, 967 through 984 here. 46 Canadian, 35 US. So let's see what we've got going on under the dust jacket. Fantastic, a little taste of what's to come. I believe this stuff was going to happen. It happens near the tail end of this deluxe. You've got Zod, Cyborg, Superman, and the Eradicator. Um... Let me flip this thing over and we'll start looking inside. So, 18 issues of Action Comics here. Um, nine months worth of content. Um, I'm still really digging Action Comics. Dan Jurgen's still writing Paul Dini in there as well. There you got the list of artists. Pretty long one. Um, that does include inkers as well. Um, but yeah, I've been really enjoying uh, Jurgen's run on on Action Comics so far, he is of course leaving the book with number 1000, after which Mr. Bendis will be taking over. Um, but there were some uh, pretty good storylines here. Uh, this first one, it's been a while since I've read it, but um, I believe one of the characters' name is Zade. Um, and you know, he's he's here to hunt hunt down uh, Superman and, and uh, Lex Luthor primarily, I think, because uh, Lex Luthor is going to be... This is a spoiler alert, so skip ahead 15 seconds if you don't want to hear it. He's going to be the future dark side. Um, and uh, basically the Zade gentleman got this prophecy, and he's here to, to change that, um, to make sure it doesn't happen. Um, we got a little dark side in there. Whether that's a dream sequence or not, I won't tell. Who knows? Um, but yeah, really, really fun arc you get. It's very conflicting because obviously... You know, you're not a fan of Lex Luthor, but at the same time, he's been doing kind of good things. And then you've got Zaid, who's trying to kill him, but at the same time, zaid has got a pretty tragic backstory. And there's this whole, uh, there's a whole bunch of, you know, you, you don't know whose side to be on. Um, but anyway, later in this volume, we get into uh, Superman Reborn, um, in which we sort of... It, it's this strange storyline where, again, I don't want to give too much away. There's, yeah, there's... um. <laughs> Ah, whatever. It's it's too bad. If you haven't read this yet, uh, you'll probably forget by the time you do. Um, Mr. Mixed Bulk, however you say his name, is in this. It's it's great. Um, I don't know if it's in these issues where we find out who Mr. Oz is. Maybe not, because I know that deluxe is just coming. Um, but that's a very cool storyline. Action Comics is a very good title, especially if you're interested in Superman and knowing what's going on um, with his character. Um, if you've been interested at all in this Mr. Oz thing, you've got to be reading Action Comics. Um, and again, you get, you know, 18 issues for 35 US cover. Um, pretty damn good. Oversized as always. Let's take a look at the binding here, guys. I mean, pretty tight, but the book does stay open really well. Um, the binding's really solidly done, as it has been with all these Re Rebirth Deluxes. Um, primarily because they are smaller volumes than the Omnibuses DC does. And as you saw, you'll get a little Zod in here as well. I'm just trying to get to the bonus content. We got some cover variant covers here. We'll Gary Frank action. Awesome. Steel. That's right. I believe Superwoman was gone at this point too. At least one of them. Yeah, not not too much for bonus content. Just some variant covers and some um, the God Slayer design. For uh, oh, Zayd and God, so that's right. I apologize, guys. It had been a while, but um, yeah, guys, if you're interested in Superman or if you're, you know, just this is the first Rebirth video of mine you're watching. Seriously, check out Action Comics. It's fun. Uh, it's got solid artwork throughout. Um, fun storylines, great character work, and uh, yeah, I'm very excited, very excited for the next volume. And just keeping my fingers crossed for the Bendis stuff. Gonna stay positive. Be optimistic. Keep an open mind. Anyway, thanks guys. If you have any questions, let me know below. This is Mike from the Hardcover Comic. And until next time, as always, you stay classy, Internet.